Welcome back to our channel, where we explore the fascinating world of electrical engineering. In today's video, we will delve into an important topic, the difference between slip ring and squirrel cage type rotors in induction motors. So, let's dive right in. Point 1. Construction The first point of difference lies in the construction of the rotors. The slip ring rotor consists of insulated copper or aluminum windings connected to external resistors through slip rings and brushes. On the other hand, the squirrel cage rotor features conductive bars made of copper or aluminum that are short-circuited by end rings. Point 2. Starting Performance In terms of starting performance, Slip ring rotors offer better control and the ability to adjust the external resistance. This enables smooth starting and reduces the starting current, making it suitable for applications with high starting torque requirements. Squirrel cage rotors, on the other hand, provide self-starting capabilities and are commonly used in applications that require frequent starts and stops. Point 3. Maintenance Slip ring rotors require additional maintenance due to the presence of slip rings and brushes, which can wear out over time and need periodic inspection and replacement. Squirrel cage rotors, being brushless, require less maintenance, making them more reliable and suitable for applications where maintenance is a concern. Point 4. Efficiency when it comes to efficiency, squirrel cage rotors are generally more efficient than slip ring rotors. The absence of additional resistance in the rotor circuit reduces power losses, resulting in higher overall motor efficiency. Point 5. Torque Control Slip ring rotors allow for external resistance to be added or reduced, providing precise control over torque characteristics. This makes them suitable for applications where variable torque control is essential. Squirrel cage rotors, however, have a fixed torque characteristic and are better suited for constant torque applications. Point 6. Speed Control Slip ring rotors offer better speed control compared to squirrel cage rotors. By adjusting the external resistance, the speed torque characteristics of slip ring motors can be tailored to specific requirements. Squirrel cage rotors have limited speed control options and are typically used in applications with constant speed requirements. Point 7. Cost In terms of cost, squirrel cage rotors are more economical to manufacture and maintain due to their simpler construction. Slip ring rotors, with the addition of slip rings, brushes, and external resistors, tend to be more expensive. Point 8. Starting Current Slip ring rotors, due to the external resistance, have lower starting currents compared to squirrel cage rotors. This feature makes them suitable for applications where high inrush currents need to be avoided. Point 9. Overload Capability Slip ring rotors exhibit better overload capability due to the ability to adjust the rotor resistance. This makes them more suitable for applications that require intermittent heavy loads or high starting torque. Point 10. Robustness Squirrel cage rotors are generally more robust and durable due to their simpler construction and lack of moving parts like slip rings and brushes. They can withstand harsh environments and are less susceptible to damage. Point 11. Application Examples Slip ring rotors find their applications in industries such as mining, cement, and heavy machinery where precise torque control and speed adjustment are required. Squirrel cage rotors are widely used in pumps, fans, compressors, and other applications that require a reliable and low maintenance operation. Point 12. Noise and Vibrations Slip ring rotors, due to the presence of brushes and slip rings, 
can generate more noise and vibrations compared to squirrel cage rotors, which operate silently and smoothly. Point 13. Commonality Finally, it's worth noting that squirrel cage rotors are the most commonly used rotor type in induction motors due to their simplicity, reliability, and cost-effectiveness. Slip ring rotors are employed in specific applications where precise control and variable characteristics are more important. And there you have it. We have explored the 13 key differences between slip ring and squirrel cage type rotors in induction motors. From construction to performance characteristics, each rotor type has its unique advantages and applications. Understanding these differences is crucial for selecting the right rotor type for specific motor applications. If you found this video informative, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more captivating content on electrical engineering. If you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to leave them in the comments section below. Thank you for joining me today and until next time. Keep exploring the electrifying world of electrical engineering.